A group of people who live in a Dundas apartment building say they're concerned about their future. They held a news conference this afternoon to address several issues, including the sale of the property. Hadi Azad was there and brings us the details. We, of course, got very nervous and we're not sure what's going to happen to us. Tenants of a couple of Forge and Foster properties in Hamilton are working together to demand support for protecting over 70 units. Some tenants have lived here at 211 York Road for up to three decades and are now worried about rent evictions. We want to find a way to ensure that our homes, our homes, remain affordable. 39 tenants currently live at 211 York Road. Acorn Hamilton says tenants in this complex are facing several challenges since Forge and Foster took over nearly two years ago. Tenants have struggled with uh, issues ranging from freezing temperatures in their apartments to recurring mold issues. This is really unacceptable, especially given the fact that some of these tenants um, have toddlers. Tenants in this building are also demanding the city to fast track plans for an acquisition fund to support at risk buildings. Um, that said, we're in a crisis today. And like I, I want to say the city acknowledges we're in a crisis today. Ward 13 Councillor Alex Wilson says he has raised this issue with staff. We've committed to building that process, reporting back on that process, staffing up in bylaw, building those teams. I can't say that's fast work. And I, I think we're hearing that it's not meeting the need in our communities today. That's a reality. Donna Hebert lives on 72 James Street, another Forge and Foster property. She says the tenants at her building are facing similar issues. As time goes on, you know, Forge and Foster's history is going to come out. <laughs> There's a lot to tell that way. I reached out to Forge and Foster, but no one in their office this afternoon would comment. And phone calls as well as emails were unanswered today. The tenants in our building are just looking to be able to live where they live, pay the rent they pay, and have some sense of what the future brings. Hattie Azat, CHCH News, Hamilton.